Hey, what's up, y'all? Welcome to the channel. So right now, I've already made it. I'm here in Oklahoma. I'm picking up another truck. To be exact, I'm going to El Reno, Oklahoma. I don't know how to exactly pronounce it. I'm going to pick up a 2004 Chevrolet Silverado that I found this morning on Marketplace. I have already sent a deposit for the truck and I'm about 30 minutes away. Sorry that I didn't get a clip when I was in Dallas, man. I've been trying to shoot over here right now. It's like 10.30. Uh, I'm trying to get back to Dallas because I got a long day tomorrow. I'm trying to get some sleep, trying to get some rest. So I'm gonna get a little interview of him and stuff like that, but I'm moving fast. This video will be really short because I'm just moving super fast. But anyway, sit back, grab your popcorn, man. Let's get it. All right, guys, so I'm here with Giovanni. I just bought this 2004 Chevrolet Silverado. We are actually in Oklahoma, and this truck has 144,000 miles. So did you get this truck here locally in Oklahoma? Yeah, I got it off of town about maybe an hour or so. Good deal. So do you do buying and selling? Is that what you do? Yeah, that's what I do. I've been doing it since my uh, junior year of high school, so it's mm -hmm. a year now and trying to upscale. So how old are you right now? I'm 17. Man. Congratulations, man. Yeah. You're doing you're doing very well. This is a very good truck right here that you found. And you make money buying, not right. selling. So good stuff on that. Uh you actually got a dealer right here buying yeah. a truck from you, man. Yeah, so that's... that should tell you a lot about right. the eye you have. Yeah, I mean, in my end, I'm like, oh man, I'm yeah. really upscaling when I got people yeah. like you yes, sir. coming yeah. here to buy my trucks. Exactly. And that's exactly how you should see it, man. Yeah. You, you did a great job. Uh so out there in the market, are you consistently looking for them on Marketplace and stuff like um, that? Every day, every day, 24-7, uh -huh. just on Marketplace. Right. So what are you seeing out there? I'm seeing just all these kinds of trucks. I mm -hmm. mean, some not too good, some exactly good, but I mean, it's hard to too get. Too much. <laughs> it's yep. Competition is really out there. Exactly. Competition. That's the exact I mean, word it is. You just got to be the fastest. You got to be the fastest and you got to be the highest bidder. Right. Yes, sir. Yeah, so uh, what got you into wanting to specialize into the cat eye? Well, first, um, I really just started uh, with my first trucks, yep. cat eyes. I saw the attention of it. Yep. And then right as I started flipping my first and second one, yeah. I got literally messages on top of messages. Yeah. And then, I mean, there's, since they're so reliable, I just started mm -hmm. researching them yeah. and just found out there's a market for them. Exactly. And then I just started buying and finding and then, I mean, everyone wants a cat eye. That's Who true. doesn't? They look good mm -hmm. as hell. You can exactly. make them good, look good as hell easy. Exactly. So, and then yeah. I just saw the market and mm -hmm. just went up from there. Yes, sir. Good deal. Uh, I will tell you, man, you have a very bright future ahead of you. Thank you, man. And I'm saying that because, like I was telling you before, mm -hmm. when I told you that I'd send you the, well, you told me right. that you only wanted a hundred dollar deposit to yeah. hold the truck. That says a lot about you, man. It right. says that. You understand two things. You understand that this truck is going to sell regardless, mm -hmm. and you know what you have. Right. You know, you have confidence. That that told me everything. That's why I was willing to go the whole day and then mm -hmm. waiting all the way until tonight to come get, come get the truck because right. I could tell, okay, this is somebody who knows what he has. You right. know, he's not, he's not, he knows that whenever somebody come and drive the truck, they're going to be sold on the truck yeah. versus somebody that's nervous or scared, they're going to kind of seem sketchy. Yeah, I don't want to do a deposit and all this and that, yeah. but, but now nah, you were confident in what you had. Yeah. Um, uh, and like I say, you make money buying, not selling. So man, you have a yeah. really, really bright future. So keep doing what you're doing. Yeah. And I, I mean, I understand sending the deposit part. Sometimes it's scary. You don't know what's yeah. going to happen on the other side. So right. for me, I wouldn't want too much deposit. Cause yeah. I mean, come see the trust. Right. You, you either want it or you don't. Yeah. Yeah. You got the right mentality, man. You, that's why I say you, you have a bright future. Yeah. And I'm, I love the the buying process, hassle free. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I mean it was. I really appreciate doing business with you. Yeah. So you see, would you say overall it was an easy transaction? Really, easy. really simple. It's really it's, simple. Is this easy. one of your most simple transactions that you've done? Simple. Overall, I tell people that all the time. I'm like, man, when you sell to me, mm -hmm. I'm not gonna come over here and beat you down about the right. truck because I know what I'm buying. How long did I test drive that truck? Like, be honest. <laughs> Across the street, missed my house. So I say. 
<laughs> two minutes. <laughs> two minutes. Exactly, man. But you know what you're looking for. That's it, man. Like that's I don't. It. We don't gotta sit up and go down the highway, man. It's I, hassle free. I went right here, and what? You, did you hear me when I said it? I said, "Oh, it's good." Yeah. And I turned right back around. Right back around. Great truck. Yeah, you. You. you I, I know these trucks just like you, man. Yeah. Um, but yeah, man, it was a pleasure doing business yeah. with you, man. And uh, I hope we can do business yep. again, bro. I but, mean, uh, I'm looking up to maybe doing more business with you. Yes, sir. And any tips you need, I'm here for you, brother. No, thank Same you. here, man. I it. If I need any tips out from you, mm -hmm. any any help I need in the Oklahoma market, yep. I'll reach out to you as yeah. well. And if you ever want to come by with a truck, yeah. I'll let you know. Yes, sir. It was a pleasure, man. All right, man. Thank yes, you. sir. All right, guys. So I got the 2004 back out here in Dallas. Sorry I didn't check in with you last night, man. I was super exhausted. I did not get home last night until 4 a.m. I barely got any sleep. I got back up, 7 o'clock this morning, got right back to it, man. So let me tell you the reason why I rushed out to Oklahoma to get this truck. For one, it was a great deal. The truck is clean. Look how clean this truck is. You got to know that white trucks are premium when we're talking about the cat eye, the white white trucks are the best. That's really the best color to have, in my opinion, because from my experience and what I, I have seen, anybody will buy a white truck. You know, people are pretty particular about the colors they like on their truck, but anybody will buy a white truck. That's number one. Two, I love the way that white looks when it's dirty and when it's clean. And white looks good with chrome. But anyway... So the reason why I rushed out there, man, is because, for one, it was a great deal. Two, I've been having a lot of people reaching out to me, checking in to see what I have for around this price point. I'm going to put this truck at $96.50, so that's the under $10,000 price point. I just sold a, a, a gold truck. You guys didn't really see that truck. If you, did not, if you don't follow my Instagram or my Facebook, if you don't keep up with me on Facebook Marketplace, you probably didn't see that truck. But I sold that truck in less than 24 hours. I put the truck at $89.50. It had 130,000 miles. It was faded all right here. It had a dented tailgate. This white truck don't have none of that. And I'm only asking $700 more. So I know I can control the market with this truck. This truck has 144,000 miles, but it's cleaner than the gold one. So I know it's going to bring the same. So look, this is what you got to understand. So the people that are reaching out to me about the gold truck that I just sold, well, I'm just going to send them this truck. That's why I had to rush out to Oklahoma before Saturday come because today is Saturday. Right now, guys, it's 930 and I just sold a truck like 10, 20 minutes ago. Don't mean I'm finna just be hella busy over here or just super crowded over here. That's not what I'm saying, but Saturday is your is a car dealer. Saturday is your highest potential day to make as many sales as possible. Whether that's only two, that's only three, or it's only one, your greatest chance of making a sale is always on a Saturday. So I had to go get this truck just to have it. And I'm, I'm probably not going to take it off the trailer. I'm probably going to leave it right here on the trailer. And if somebody show up, I'm going to tell them, hey, oh, you want, oh, you, oh, you want something in that price point? Boom. 96.50. Come on with it. I really got a guy in Shreveport. I'm trying to work with him. We're talking right now. But we'll see, man. I, I, I think I could, if, if, if the right person show up, I could sell this truck today. And I will drop a clip, an interview clip, if I end up selling this truck. But like I say, it's only 930 in the morning right now. I'm just, I'm just talking, you know what I'm saying? But on the other hand, uh, I'm sorry I didn't touch back in last night after the interview. Like I say, I was super tired. But this truck right here, I believe it has the potential to run the market right now, just like the gold one did. Man, <laughs> I'm going to drop this interview clip of the gold truck I sold real, real quick. All right, guys, I'm here with Antonio. He is buying a 2004 Chevrolet Silverado LS with 135,000 original miles. Now, first thing I want to ask you, man, how was your experience today with me? My experience here at your at your uh, auto sales. Yes, sir. It was it was really good. Yeah, it was really good, man. You treat people with honesty, respect. Yes, sir. And I think you know that goes that goes a long way with anybody you're dealing with. I agree. Yes, sir. One thing I'll say, man, you one hell of a negotiator, man. Well, you know, <laughs> I gotta you give it to you, man. <laughs> <laughs> you were... so are you, man. <laughs> yeah, right on. We was kind of going at it a little bit, but hey, man, yeah, I'm, yeah. I'm glad that that I was able to help you out and you you're getting your son a truck and stuff like this. So greatly appreciate it on that doing business yeah. with me. Okay. But, um, what did you see out there looking for used trucks in the market? What were you seeing? 
Man, I was looking at these trucks, obviously. Right. And, uh, you know, for the most part, man, they were beat up. You know, they yep. were, you know, they had high mileage. Yes, sir. They were tampered with. Right. I was looking for something more original, more stock. And this is what, you know, this is what I was looking for, you know. Yeah. Uh, low miles, obviously. And uh, yep. decent condition. I can't expect it to be in perfect condition because it is a 20 year old truck. Exactly. But I think looking at this truck is, you know, it's what I was looking for. So yeah. what exactly sold you on it? What were like any any key points that sold you on the truck? Well, the the key point here was the interior. It's it's clean. It's super clean. Yes, sir. And the low mileage. It's a 2004. Yep. And it's only got 135,000 miles. So yes, that's, sir. That's you know if you average it out, this truck was driven maybe 6,500 yep. miles a year. Exactly. You know, so that's very low mileage. Yes, sir. I agree. Yeah. So compared to what else you were seeing out there, was that lower than what you were typically seeing on average? Was that lower mileage compared to everything else you it were seeing? It definitely was. Okay. Because your average truck, from what I saw, from my experience, looking at, you know, for maybe five to six weeks, yeah, I think most trucks had between 160 to 220. Right. 220,000 miles, you know, and that was, obviously, that's that's pretty normal. That's your standard yes, for a 20-year-old truck. truck. Yeah. Right. So I think, you know, the, the key point to this truck was the mileage being, you know, 130,000. That was, yeah. that was, that was really what got me here, you know, and yeah. the interior, you know, it, 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 it tells you everything you need to know about the truck. Like exactly you have right. Yep. All right, man. Last question. Uh, what do you think about the future of the cat eye? Because I know you were saying you specifically looking for 03 to 07, two questions in one. So okay. what do you think about the future of the cat eye? And also why were you specifically looking for a cat eye? You know, it wasn't really me. It was my son. Okay. He was the one looking for the cat eye. Mm -hmm. uh, so I'm just really fulfilling his, you know, his his wishes, you know, on, on the, right. the the front end he wanted. I got you. The particular front end. He didn't want the 99, the 02, you know, the bubble eye. Yes, sir. He wanted the cat eye. Okay. And I think it's it's popular. It's a popular truck for a bunch of teenagers right now. Most definitely. Yeah. But I, I admire his, you know, his, uh, his view on it. Yeah. I, I see what he sees. Yeah. I see the potential. And I think the cat eye... I also think the Cat Eye is a very, it's a, it's a, it's a very unique truck. It's not, yes. well, it's more of a, it was only made for, you know, short period of time. Exactly. From 03 to 07. Right. So I think that makes it extra special. Period. Yeah. Yep. Definitely. Well, man, it was a pleasure doing business with you today. Uh, Mr. Duran, you've been hell of a customer, man. Uh, like I say, hell of a negotiator too. Uh, it was a pleasure, man. I, I hope this truck serves you well, you and your son. Uh, I hope uh, you keep doing your thing, man, running your, your business here. Yes, sir. Uh, and I uh, I hope, you know, uh, everything yeah. goes well for you, man. You yes, know, sir. You're doing well. I appreciate yeah. that, man. You take Thank care you. now. Yes, sir. Thanks. Okay, now that you've seen that interview, you know, you know what I'm talking about now. Sorry I didn't do a walk around video or anything like that on the gold truck. The reason why I didn't, though, is because that truck was kind of a, I was testing the market. I was trying to see, okay, can I can I take this truck with a dent on the tailgate, faded faded bedside, and I think it had a faded hood too. It was like it had like rust spots right here. Can I take this truck? And it had bad tires, but it was good. It was a great truck. It was a good running truck. I was just trying to see how hot is the market because if this truck sells as is, compa the comparables out there, the stuff that's out there for sale is junk. So if this truck sells as is, if this gold truck can sell as is, I know that my my eye, my quality can run the game, right? And that's what happened. I ran the game with the quality. But on the other hand, I'm doing the same thing with this truck. But this truck is actually clean. Like the body is clean as hell. Look at it, man. You see it? Look at this truck. Look at I got brand, damn near brand new tires on the truck. I'm finna change out these headlights. I'm finna J. Anthony badge it, and I'm gonna leave it right here on the trailer. It's just gonna sit here. It sell or it don't. But Monday, I'm gonna get busy on it. But if I if I can sell it today without a detail, then that's what we gonna do. But let me give y'all a quick walk around tour on this truck, cause I know that's what y'all begging for. So let's get. It.
right guys, so here we go. 2004 Chevrolet Silverado 1500. Bought it last night out of Oklahoma. Nice truck, nice truck. And originally guys, I really don't like those chrome wheels they put on these trucks, but, but in this instance, they actually do this truck a lot of justice because the truck is white and the rims are chrome. So that, that helps this truck out big time. Let's really get a good look at this truck, man. Nice truck. Under $10,000, 144,000 original miles. You got a little curb right there. Not bad at all, especially for a truck in this price range with these kind of miles. Look at the bed, bed is fairly clean. Nice truck, you ask me, man. Really nice truck. Let me get this front angle right here, this side. Whoo, pretty truck, pretty truck. I'm glad I went out there to o Oklahoma to get this truck, man. I'm really excited about it. Look at this, look at this. Now the market hasn't seen this truck yet, but my fan base has. My Instagram has, my Facebook page has, and now my YouTube channel has. But the, all, the, the overall market has not seen this truck yet. So truck does have a 5.3. Let me come over here. I'm gonna start it up. I'll let you hear. Nice, man. Real nice, actually. Oh yeah. She's pretty, man. Original LS too. Start this puppy up, man, so y'all can hear her curl a little bit. Oh yeah, I wanna hear that. Hold on, guys. See if I can get that. Oh, could have let me. Nice. Good deal. Nice truck, man. Nice truck. So, 9650 is what I'm going to ask for. I think that's fair price for what it is. Look at those rockers. Oh, yeah. Let's look at this undercarriage. Not bad. 20 year old truck. Not bad for a 20 year old truck, huh? Not bad at all. You can't beat that. A lot of orange dirt because it's from Oklahoma. But it's clean though. But yeah, guys, if you're interested, reach out to me, man. I'm trying to bless somebody game because my opinion it's a ten thousand five hundred to eleven thousand dollar truck all day just because it's a white cat eye you know with a straight body on it that's what's helping this truck so reach out to me man if you're interested but anyways appreciate you guys for tuning in that's all i got for you today please like and subscribe jay anthony out Wow, 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 wow.